to the people. I was creating and learning and begin to build ideas. Well, I feel like everybody in the world has to be creative in some type of way. And it ain't gotta be making music or it ain't gotta be entertaining somebody. We are creative people. I used to want to be an athlete. I had other plans. Like music wasn't always like it wasn't my first love, but you know what I'm saying. You don't always marry your first love. Yeah. I got kicked out of college and all of that stuff. Kind of messed up school. Well, I came back to the crib and, and got kicked out the crib. And all I had was the whip my grandma bought me. And that was like, man, I had to figure something out. Moment. And I was living in my car. I was delivering pieces. I was. Uh, sleeping in it, just trying to figure out how I was going to move forward. I had gas, that's what I did have, and I had my notepads accessible, just writing and coming up with material and ideas and stuff, and trying to like direct myself. Whatever greatness is for me, I was going to work towards it. Talking about a face tap, where your waist get? Pull up on your placemat, where your safe at? Music just helped me decide and just helped me show that I could just make my own way and that I wanted to make my own way. The creative part of it was just a part of my life. I'm creative, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. I know how to make something out of nothing. I always know how to do that. Hold on, wait. I got to get it in. I committed to sin. I pray to the Lord, forgive me again. Just give me a chance. Give me a chance. Please, please. I pull up on a nigga and blah, blah. I just remember my manager had the equipment and he brought it to our house. When he brought that equipment to the crib, it was just like opening up a chest case and you know when the, the gold hit your face and everybody's standing around. We all had the same look on our face. Like, wow, this can change our lives. As soon as I learned how to record myself, track it, and bounce it, it was over. Um, even before I met you, I already knew you was evil, crazy, because had the thing you would do to the people. I was barely a barely and began to build ideas and thoughts. Start bearing my crosses, my path is often misguided. When I listen and look into your eyes, I either get lost in it or see something that's hardening. Hearts living on my sleeve, it's harder to breathe without you, but with you I bleed, followed by scream. And I was always taught that I was meant for some higher purpose. My brothers and sisters, we always raised that type of way, no matter what type of direction we went, we was raised like a battery pack on our back. Both of my brothers, like one of them like super wild, like one of the football players, the, the one of the jock, you know what I'm saying? And then my other one was like super eclectic, can draw, can sing. And just show you just like how genes are spread down, because I'm like, I got a mixture of all of that. It went from us playing video games, hit listening to all the songs, Rapping the song, singing the song, <laughs> all the ad libs, like he killing all the songs. That when I turned it up. Yeah, listen, yeah. man, I took a video at his last show in Atlanta. I was like, damn, this is a rockstar. Right. And then, and, and the, the, the like the how proud and full I was. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. damn, that's my fucking baby brother. Oh, never have, never do this damn, but the nigga never gave two. Never been a, never had a rollie on a wrist. Never had. I want people to find creativity in their life, no matter what they're doing in any situation. If you know how to make a meal out of nothing, you created. Pay a bill and you ain't got no money to do that. When you made it happen, that's created to me. Regardless of what it is. We all created people. Never been this, never had this, never knew this, never out, never do this, damn, but in it.